Welcome back. Drinkers of Distinction. Well, hope everyone's Easter went well, going well. I don't, I don't know. It's Monday today. I don't even know what, what's the main day of Easter, but anyway. Got some Dayton Pink Flamingo uh, Lemonade Sour. Focus for us. I thought I had it fucking worked out, but never mind. But yeah, I'm not usually a massive sour fan, but I um, I had this once before, but I didn't review it. I think I bought it with the intention of reviewing it, and just didn't get around to it. So here we go. Look at that beautiful colour. Mmm. Raspberry, raspberry lemonade? It could be. Looks raspberry, doesn't it? I think it might be raspberry. If you didn't know it was beer, you'd think it was soft drink, wouldn't you? Hmm. I don't mind that. Flamingos are cool. Why? Because they don't <laughs> give a fuck. They're out there flamingoing all day, every day, whether you like it or not. Be a flamingo, you brilliant creature, you. No preservatives, keep me curled. I'll tell you what, it's, it's slightly dry. It's obviously not, you know, super sweet because it's a sour. But it's, it's not, I, I think it's well balanced. <laughs> I'm more or less using it as a bit of a palate cleanser. So I had an IPA I'm not reviewing. And I got some more, I got the this year's Dark Harvest Vintage. <laughs> and a four pack of Black Hops X-Ray double IPA I think but yes and then I thought well I haven't reviewed this yet so hmm yeah it's nice sort of got a sherbet mouthfeel except it's not powdery and sugary and, and that But yeah, I usually don't like sour, but I find the uh, flamingo is not, it's not too bitey, nice and balanced. So there you go. If you've seen it and you wonder what it's like, so I guess it'd be like a raspberry sour, basically. So there you go. Hope uh, to be informative and all that good shit. So, please sit and take care. Fucking don't get too wasted, right? Stay distinctive. Catches. <laughs> <laughs>